Whitley County Commissioners are still working on drafting an ordinance for wind turbines. Wind Capital Group hopes the county will house turbines soon, but one family says leaders there should think twice. News Channel 15's Megan Royce joins us live from Studio 15 tonight. So, Megan, why do they think it's a bad idea? Well, Mark, the family speaking out against it lives within a mile radius of 13 wind turbines in DeKalb County, Illinois. They say their quality of life has changed for the worse. No longer do David and his family live a quiet life in the country. Instead, they say it's been replaced with an almost constant noise and strobing effect from wind turbines. We were told all these things like, oh, you know, you're not having any issues with them, but we do, we have issues, and it's not just us. We're on an isolated case. Once all teens went viral with their problem, they started receiving emails from others who felt the same. They were told the noise generated from the turbines would sound like a refrigerator. But once the turbines went online, the whole teens experienced something different. They just were misleading because, I mean, oftentimes they sound like airplanes that are circling our home. And there's like a different air pressure um, at our home, and we can even feel a different air pressure in our home. The whole teens are encouraging Whitley County residents to require turbine companies build farther away from homes. If not, others may find themselves in a similar situation, putting their homes up for sale like the whole teens are about to. This is a home that my husband built with his own hands and um, from, you know, from the area that he grew up in. Um, all our children came home from the hospital in this home, and it's, it's like an estate to us. A concerned citizens group invited the Hall teens to come speak Tuesday. That's because members want to make sure residents' rights are protected. We are not against alternative energy. What we're looking for is equitable um, ordinance that everybody can live with. Long says commissioners and residents will take the Hall teens' experience into consideration. So far, 19,000 acres of land has been promised to Wind Capital Group to build turbines. A new ordinance will be drafted before turbines go up. Basically, it was just protection of the property rights of the people that were participating and non participating. Now, it's not clear exactly when Whitley County commissioners will have a final ordinance drafted, but they're hoping it'll be in the next few months. In Studio 15, Megan Royst, News Channel 15.